Let us formulate the off angle formulae related to the properties of triangle in terms of A, B, C, semi perimeter S and delta. So, they are very very important while solving the problems in properties of triangle. So, today let us discuss one of the off angle formulae. So, the first one is so let us formulate sin of A by 2. So, using that one by cyclic using cyclic cyclic order. So, easily we can write the value of sin of b by 2 and sin of c by 2. First let us derive sin of a by 2. So, in order to derive sin of a by 2, we need to recall the 2 sin square a by 2 equals to 1 minus cos a. You might be recollecting from the multiples and sub multiple chapter. So, first let us recall the formula then so, let us solve it using cosine rule only. So, now here to find or to formulate sin of a by 2. That means, we are going to formulate sin of a by 2. Consider 2 sin square a by 2 this equals to 1 minus cos a. Am I right? Let us replace cos a. Cos a equals to b square plus c square minus a square by 2 b c. So, now this equals to 1 minus of b square plus c square minus a square by 2 b c. So, you had better to formulate it easily you can remember the formula. So, now 1 minus or oh sorry this is 2 B C is the LCM. We have 2 B C minus of B square minus C square plus A square. So, now let us rearrange the terms of numerator. This can be written like this A square and take minus common we have b square plus c square minus 2 b c upon 2 b c. So, you may get one doubt why should we write like that? Because the b square plus c square minus 2 b c is in the form of a perfect square a minus b whole square. That means, b square plus c square minus 2 b c can be put in the form of b minus c whole square as b minus c whole square. So, the next step this equals to a square minus of b minus c whole square upon 2 b c. Just observe in the numerator. The numerator is in the form of a square minus b square form, which is the product of a plus b and a minus b. Am I correct? So, now this is in the form of a square minus b square, which equals to a plus b into a minus b. Here capital A stands for small a here, capital B stands for B minus C. So, we get here A plus B means A plus of B minus C. Am I correct? The next one is A minus B small a and minus of B minus C means minus B plus C upon 2 B C. See, since we have perimeter a plus b plus c equals to 2 s. So, as to write in terms of 2 s. So, now a plus b minus c can be written a plus b plus c minus 2 c a plus b plus c minus 2 c. It will not change we get the same value. So, now this can be written a plus b plus c minus 2 b upon 2 b c. So, now here this a plus b plus c a plus b plus c is being replaced by 2 s. We get 2 s minus 2 c this also 2 s minus 2 b upon 2 b c. Take 2 common 2 common that means 4 times we get s minus b 
एस माइनस सी अपॉन टू बी सी दिस इज टू टू जै दिस इज नथिंग बट वी हैव सी टू साइन स्क्वायर ए बाई टू टू साइन स्क्वायर ए बाई टू इक्वल्स टू टू टाइम्स एस माइनस बी एस माइनस सी बाई बी सी नाउ वॉट विल द नेक्स्ट स्टेप डू यू एक्सपेक्ट इट एस द टू टू कैन बी गेट्स कैंसल we have sin square a by 2 is equal to s minus b into s minus c upon bc we need to write a sin of a by 2 that is root of root over s minus b s minus c upon bc this is the formulation of sin of a by 2 it has been formulated so sin of a by 2 is very simple to remember s minus b s minus c upon bc square root root over so you may get one doubt generally plus or minus why should we take plus sign because a b c are the angles of the triangle simultaneously a by 2 becomes the actually here acute angle so we need to consider positive sign so sin of a by 2 is equal to root over s minus b s minus c by bc so if you want to write Similarly, sine of b by two. Do you expect the value? Right on root over. So b means you won't get any b, small b, element b. We have to make use of here c a. So we can write s minus c s minus a upon c a. Can you write sine c by two? Let us try. The sine c by two is equal to. You can write like this. root over s minus a s minus b and ab so this is the formulation 